Jim Lunky, owner of Safety Connections. And my blurb for the week of November 25th, 2024. Leaders mindset. Just a continuation on that communication type stuff, but I really believe it is a mindset. So these are the things that come to mind. Inspiring others starts by focusing on what? Your audience, what their needs are. Whether we're addressing a small group, a large crowd, an individual. Shouldn't really make a difference. Yeah, we adjust to who we're talking to. But it's vital and critical to think about what your audience is looking for and how you can meet those expectations. That's what I think is, is critical. When you ask yourself, what would your audience want to hear and what you have to say? You begin to think about their needs instead of focusing on your nerves about speaking in front of a huge crowd or a boss or a boss's boss. That's what comes to my mind as a starter. And then how do we, how do we cultivate confidence? I think it's believing in our abilities to inspire others by embracing a sense of purpose, if you will, and transforming information into inspiration. Putting your audience first. You lay down the groundwork for effective leadership communication. Principles are part of the large framework that can help one build and maintain confidence in any situation. I recently had a situation where it was a contract that someone wanted to move on. And at, at that point, don't, have no need for our service. Not of what we did wrong, nothing like that. But how you deal with that? Well, sometimes truly, it gives me and it should others an inspiration that where one door closes, another one opens. And creating a new challenge and new connections is not a bad thing. So that's just how it was dealt with. By intriguing oneself into the interaction every day, building that leadership's mindset that not only enhances one's own confidence, but also emp empowers you as a leader to what? Enhance, improve, and motivate and inspire others. And to do that effectively every time you speak. <clears throat> Excuse me, I, I just want to close with, uh, also got that on, on some of my shirts, the three R's. And I, I use that also with the grandkids about being in this order. And I always think about that as we try to inspire, to be respectful, reliable, and responsible. That's my message for the week. Have a great week, everyone, and I'll look forward to our next, our next blurb. Take care.